Amy Evans moved into this Druid Hills home back in 1973. It was just a nice place to be. Quiet and just good neighbors. It was wonderful. Evans also retired from the nearby Careway Hospital after 28 years. But then the hospital closed, causing the neighborhood she loves to start to lose its luster. The economic, we had went down, the neighborhood went down, people moved out. Soon though, many will start to move back in. Today, the city approved a $13 million incentive deal to help replace the dilapidated hospital with a massive development featuring restaurants, apartments, and a hotel. This is a project that is a game changer for the city of Birmingham. We're just excited about the future of, of the Caraway campus. To put the scope of this project into perspective, consider this. The new downtown protective stadium was set to cost $174 million to construct, and the new Northside redevelopment investment just a few blocks away is worth twice that much. Robert Simon, whose company Corporate Realty is developing the site, said, Today's City Council vote affirms all of our collective efforts and clears the way for what will be the largest private investment in the history of Birmingham. And Evans' home of the last 47 years sits only a few blocks away. Ooh, wow, isn't that wonderful? Now we hope we can get some new homes put in so we can draw some of the younger people. The hospital's demolition begins next spring. In Birmingham, John Papke, WVTM 13.